I'm uh, Gareth Preston, I'm the Motorcycle Technical Advisor here at EBC Brakes. Normally I deal with all technical inquiries regarding to motorcycle brakes, so that would be from discs, pads, or I even do clutches and brake lines. Stuff that I normally deal with is either sort of anyone with run out on their discs or if they've used the disc, disc pads too um, hot, we get all that kind of stuff come in. Um, clutches, normally I would have to do um, applications, find out which ones suit your bike and your riding style first uh, and then if we haven't got a clutch listed I'll make a clutch for you. Uh, so I've worked at ABC for three and a half years now. I um, started back in 2017 after leaving insurance, uh, came over here, uh, wanted to get a bit more hands-on with motorcycle uh, development. Recently I've taken over the sponsorship side, uh, so motorcycle racing, uh, from superbikes down to sidecars and some motocross stuff as well. So if you're into racing or if you are racing, uh, get in contact and uh, I'll see if I can help you out. Uh, so I enjoy working at EBC, um, it's a really great atmosphere, uh, everyone here is really friendly, uh, we really do get on with it like a family. You know, coming from Friday afternoons where we do stuff to each other's cars in the garage, uh, to even nights out when we go down into town. Uh, Christmas dues, you know, we really are a really tight, tight family and I'm really glad that I started working here. Uh, I've never felt so right in a job before. Uh, all my feedback or opinions or anything that I have to put to the team, it's all, all always welcomed. Uh, I never feel that I'm left out or sort of put, put aside. It is a really great place to work. Uh, we do some really great products and I'm running them on my bike here. I've got uh, the sintered pads and the normal plain rotor discs. Uh, this is my girlfriend's car. Uh, we've recently put uh, grooved and dimpled discs and blue stuff on that uh, and it will be out on track soon. Uh, technically it's my car because I do all the work to it so the, the amount of um, labour cost that she owes me it's more than what the car's worth so really it's my car. Uh, so my first car because I've only literally had my license for four years my first car was a Mazda 6 which was a basic car. Uh, when I finished with it, I had changed a lot of it. I changed all the bumpers, the side skirts, suspension, um, literally made a complete different car. Uh, you'll probably see a picture come up in a minute. Bike-wise, I've had um, quite a few. When I first started riding my 125s, there were the Chinese 125s, uh, so like Sky Team, um, uh, Jinlun as well. Uh, then I realized that the, the Japanese bikes were much better. So I started with my, when I had my full license, started on a nice 1999 ZX6R. Um, it was I custom sprayed in um, the Focus ST Orange, um, had black bits all across it. Um, it won best bike in show, a few bike shows. I uh, got trophies for it. Then I went and um, had an accident, had a, quite a big accident, um, basically missed a corner. Uh, 80 mile an hour, hit a tree, broke my back in several places, uh, broke all my ribs on my right side, smashed my collarbone, I've now got a plate in there. Seven weeks after the accident, I was down in London picking up a 1400, ZZR 1400, um, and then I had that for three years. I sold that a couple of years ago, uh, mainly because I was focusing on the Mazda. And then last year, I got the bug, wanted to get out of the summer, so I went and brought this. Um, it was a mint condition 1400, first one, 2007, um, really low mileage. And so far I've changed, um, well, everything. I've changed the wheels, the exhausts, the, um, I've put a Dynajet kit on it. Um, I'm hoping that it's gonna be running over 200 brake. I need to do a dyno when everything's open. Um, but yeah, that's, um, everyone says I'm crazy, but it's, it's a bike that I've always loved. Big Kawasaki fan. Um, so that's me. Um, so thanks very much for watching. Um, if you have any bike queries uh, or if you have any technical in queries or anything at all bike related, give me a call. Uh, our number's on the website and I'll speak to you soon.